everyone and welcome to our vlog. As you know, I'm Ray, I'm your SU president. And I'm Noel, your SU vice president. We've done loads since we spoke to you last in our last vlog. We had, of course, Mini Oktoberfest in the middle of October, which of course included a mystery tour to, Tru to Tralee. And we had magician Steve Spade in as well. I think everyone had good crack that week. We've also had Mary Eyes, the Mary Eye Factory even, uh, which took place at Dolan's in November. Well done to Neil Barry. He was the overall mm -hmm. winner of that. And well done to everyone who turned up as well. There was a good crowd there to support. And of course, in the last couple of weeks, we had Mary Eye's first ever Christmas days, Yay. which uh, went down a great success. That took part took place in Scots and it was in Jolene then at night time. And of course, it was suggested by students to get one, and we did. The pool table is now in the lounge, so happy pooling. Mm -hmm. I think the majority of the suggestion box suggestions since September were pool table. Pool table. Um, and there's also the games. The games machine as well, yeah. yeah. Um, on to slightly more serious matters, um, we haven't been talking to you in so long, the national protest has happened since and well done to everyone from Mary I who turned out for that, that was a great success in that. Yeah. We also featured in the INTO magazine, oh, In yeah. Touch, yeah. Uh, pictures of us at the march. So. Um, and <laughs> and um, the another campaign that's been running in the meantime is tellyourtd.com, um, you may have seen some flyers and posters about it around the college. Literally, you log on to www.tellyourtd.com. You pick your constituency, you fill in your details, and you click send. And it's already a pre-written letter to your TD to tell them to protect education in the, bud in the budget, particularly third level education. And that's just ongoing, so that can be done anytime. And it'll only take a minute. Um, in other news, great news, um, there are some students out there, and I have heard feedback regarding. Um, IT classes or lack thereof for people who come to college and feel like their IT skills are not you know at the level that they would hope so at the beginning of next semester um, maybe not week one but maybe we'll see maybe week two or three uh, we'll run classes um, for maybe about five or six weeks um, for students who now this is basic computer skills and um, this is for anyone who feels like you know just the basic things like word powerpoint all the rest of it that they're having difficulty with so if that's something and um, that you really feel you'd like to avail of then please come down to the SU and sign up for it so we can get numbers and get it sorted Something else we're working on at the moment to help you through college is for any students who appeal their teaching practice grades, uh, we are working on a section of the website whereby it'll have all the frequently asked questions, how to go about it, what to do, what you need to bring in with you, who's in there, what the run of this situation is. And of course, remember, if you are thinking about going for a teaching practice appeal, uh, you are allowed to bring someone in and it'll either be the SU president of Marin or myself. So. Do get in contact if over the next few months you feel like appealing a grade and keep an eye on the website. We will obviously tell you all when it is all up and running as well. In terms of rag week forward slash hot week, hot week was the name decided by you, the students, um, voted on the website. We run a democracy here. Um, you decided hot week, which is helping others together week because like a lot of colleges, all across Ireland, um, Rag Week needs to be rebranded in order for it to continue. Um, so hot week it is. Um, if anyone has any suggestions for anything that they, you know, they think would be great during the week, something a bit different, anything like that, just either pop it into the suggestion box or come down, call into my office anytime and let me know what you're thinking in terms of bands or, or anything else like that. Um, and regarding that as well, I know a lot of you, just to clarify, a lot of you would have class reps who stood up in your class and asked for the euro, as far as I know. Yeah. Um, just to clarify on that, that was, because uh, I think there's some confusion over where it came from. Um, the money for Rag Week comes purely out of, Hot Week, comes purely out of, um, the money made at entertainment events attended by Mary Eye students um, that's organised by us. We've had events every week, um, some have done great, some have done not so great um, and basically it's all about student contribution to the entertainments fund, there isn't a magical pot there for entertainments um, and it was decided when that was put to Union Council and explained to them, um, the feedback was first of all students don't realise that and second of all they think that there should be more of a student contribution so that was the idea came up at Union Council um, and so they went forward with it because Union Council are in charge of us. Yes exactly, <laughs> I don't think students realise that as well. No, we are yeah. kind of, not dictated to but decided but Union, Union Council, Council make the, yeah. the decisions. Exactly. Um, in other news if you do want to keep up to the, obviously because we want to keep the videos short if you log on to mysu.ie our blogs we update them regular enough um, with what we're up to and that can keep you up to date with other the bits that we leave out of the video because otherwise we'll be here for like an hour. 
I have two more things to say. First of all, well done to everybody who got involved for the Breast Cancer Awareness uh, Action of Breast Cancer. We raised loads of money, and the same for Movember. Well done. We think it was great, a great response. Loads of money was raised. And there is currently a big box in the Tara forum um, for Toys for Tubs. So if you have um, a toy um, for St. Vincent de Paul, please drop it into the big box. Um, also, best of luck in your exams before Christmas. Hope they all go well and it all isn't too stressful for you either. Exactly. And just remember the SU is here. There's a gazillion support services in this college between the chaplaincy, the counselling service. So do keep in mind during the exam season and approaching Christmas that, you know, they're all there, make sure to take breaks, and if you're feeling the stress, please do take a break. And of course, happy Christmas! Happy Christmas! Yay! And we'll talk to you next semester. Bye! Bye. <laughs>